Thank you very much for staying with TV3. This is Midday Live. And uh, as I mentioned uh, a second ago, there is a derailed train. And our correspondent has joined us. An area where you get to before um, heading towards at, um, Instawam. And when we got here, we understand the train has derailed. And so we are currently here. And then what now the drivers or the engineers here have done is that they have moved the last four of the coaches our way and so now they are moving with only two and that is the only thing that can be done now for the train to get to and so on so the fact the last four of the coaches had been removed and so we are going along with only two and so when we get there and uh, we are told that later and um, engineers and other workers will come in here to pick up um, the rest of the train that had been left here and so that is the situation so people are just stranded here and so um, we are here and then we hopefully we are um, we will be getting on board again and get to Insawam and then come back to Accra so that is the situation here the train got to Chinto the area before Insawam and it derailed that is the situation here right now. Evelyn Tankma, TV3 News. All right, so uh, we, are, we are grateful that uh, the passengers are all safe. Life is very important. And as you saw in the visuals there, it's a seven-coach train. Three uh, has been taken on or is still going to work. Four of them have been detached or decoupled from the, from the, the rest, and uh, engineers will be picking up later. But do stay with us. We'll bring you further updates as to uh, whichever other angles we'll be developing from this story. The